Mac B, Sports Hop Television out of Los Angeles. Let's talk about this year has been, let's talk about this year has been challenging yeah. for you physically. Yeah. Let's talk about how you've been able to come back. Yeah. And not only the physical ability to come back, but the mental toughness yeah. that you've exemplified and how you take that leadership and toughness and translate it over to the team as a whole. Let's talk about that. Well, hey, I've tried to do my part. This team has great mental toughness. It has nothing to do with uh, with me. Uh, we got tough guys, we got great football players, but I think being patient all year has helped me. Um, uh, uh, you know, having a belief that uh, all these challenges and the different things that have occurred are, you know, happening for a reason. And I, I kind of had a piece about it, you know, for whatever reason throughout the whole time. I, I never really got, you know, too low or too down. And, you know, I just tried to work through it. And I think staying patient um, uh, uh, really worked well for me. But, yeah, there's no question that, that there's it's been a mental challenge as well as a, as a physical challenge. And, I'm certainly fortunate to be back out on the field where you can participate and contribute. Uh, it's more fun to be dressed in a uniform than, than to be in those street clothes uh, on Sunday and to be able to help the team out. You're currently tied with Brett Favre for the most wins all time. You're at 199. How would it feel going into the biggest game of your career, the biggest stage, to get that 200th and, win? And Tell me about that. You know, you know, kind of being being tied with, with Brett Favre you know, for, for, for a record is, is an honor, you know, and I think it's kind of a cool thing. And so I've never been, it's never been a goal of mine to, to, to set, you know, NFL quarterback records. It's just the ultimate team game. But when you, when you break a record or share a record with some of your favorite quarterbacks, like a Dan Marino or a Brett Favre, uh, a John Elway, it's a, uh, it's a pretty cool thing. Those guys are my heroes you know, growing up, and so um, it, it's a. I'm very grateful for those uh, you know, types of uh, type, types of opportunities. Okay,